I'm Kristen Kish, and you're watching Character Media. Kitchen culture is a thing that I'm incredibly passionate about simply because growing up and coming up into the kitchens that I did, it was never bad, but it could have been better. And so if there's anything that I can do for my team is set the stage and set an expectation of kindness. I always tell my chef, he doesn't have to be nice, but he has to be kind. So you can have authority, you can say no, you can reprimand, you can hold people accountable, because ultimately we're running a business and you have to do your job, but you can say it with kindness and a teaching that hopefully someone can learn something out of. I also find it just easier to be nice. For a long time, sometimes I would get angry and the times that I would get angry in a kitchen was because I was completely insecure in my own being. So when you realize that vulnerability and the mistakes and the mess ups are actually okay, then everything kind of starts to settle. I think it's changing. The more and more we hear about amazing chefs and their restaurants and their kitchens, I think sets an expectation to be better in your own space. I hope that this new reboot of Netflix's Iron Chef inspires the home chefs and the home cooks to explore other cuisines and cultures outside of their norm. Watching all this happen, I'm incredibly inspired by foods and flavors, and I'm learning different names of spices and dishes and how things are used because ultimately America's a melting pot like that. And what better way to celebrate food than all together, bringing it all to the table and all learning about something that's new and different to us. If I had to say one word, it's overwhelming. It is um, an honor and it's a place that little Kristen would never believe she would be if I told her. My Coriam, I was a baby. Yeah. That's me. This was 2015. I still have the shag, I wore it on one of the episodes. We were in the tea in the subway and someone said, can you just like dance down the platform? And I was like, oh my God, if you were to ask me to do that now, I'd be uncomfortable, but I would totally have fun with it. I was so self-conscious. So this little self-conscious Kristen could be on a platform like Netflix the amount of growth that I've seen within myself, I'm just astonished. The things that never would have gotten me to this place got me there because it was just me. Yeah. Isn't that weird how that works out? Yeah. You don't have to be anybody except for yourself. Yeah.